I come from a very religious family. My dad is very educated in the Middle East. Uh, my mom is not educated. They're very, very protective, especially like when it comes to like religious rules and stuff like that. And I never thought of there being a world even outside my city. Coming to the US, they were a bit skeptical, worried about, you know, how I would maintain my values. I remember first time coming to Houston, I felt like, was this like heaven where like all these people from different backgrounds are able to like coexist? I had the best host family experience ever. My host dad was Catholic and my host mom is not religious, but you know, being a Muslim coming in, like we were very, very open-minded. So my host mom and I, you know, had such a great bond. She would have like conversations that even my family at home was never able to have with me. I had one host sister who was playing soccer and that I used the opportunity to also watch the men's team. And I was looking at them like, like I can do way better than what they're doing. After I worked on the, on the field, the rest was history. Colleges actually started contacting the coach and he was amazed because no, like he has never had a player who had attracted you know, college interest. And I got a phone call and it's like, hey, I'm Nick from UCLA and we're interested in bringing you down. That was another turning point in my life. I always call this place a land of opportunity, you know, a place where you can actually be whatever you want to be. You know, Ghana is a place where there's a lot of opportunity. And since moving back, I'm like, hey, they don't have this, they need that. So I, you know, as a sportsman, you know, I started my own sports apparel company. You know, of course, my first love, soccer. I, I had to go back into soccer somehow. So I, I went back to my old club team. You know, they needed like some help in terms of like opportunities and resources. So I basically bought that club. Ever since, we've brought four players to American colleges here and four players to high school to okay. play soccer. Back then, I was a completely different person, very engulfed in my world. Of course, I know there's America, but it was never a goal to like actually see what, what they had to offer. Coming on the YES program like became like a catalyst for that. I think ever since I, I, I pride myself in being a global competent person. I try to travel to like, you know, other countries and, you know, take risks, being more open-minded. So yeah, I'm really thankful for that year.